Bob and Autogroup pick struck to the infield. Tyler Gunn, Caleb Henry. Going to bring us down to Brandon Bliss in the green flag, eight laps. First of three heat races for the Cali's Performance Products 410 Sprint. Loud pedal drop, green out, here we go. Great start for Tyler Gunn and the family on 68G. Caleb Henry in second, Cale Thomas up the third. Look at Chris Anders from the back of the pack, trying to make things work on the high side. Got off on the horse track. The orange and black 15 Sam Chris Andrews on the move. Stuart Brubaker in the four spot. Sterling Kling, the fifth and final transfer position. His first ever visit to Attica Raceway Park. Chris Andrews up into the sixth position. Tyler Gunn rim rides out of turn four. Caleb Henry follows his tire track. Stuart Brubaker, the only car to step out of line and try that bottom side of the speedway. Stuart Brubaker in the four spot. Sterling Kling in fifth, but here comes Chris Andrews with a head of steam. Kling going to take a peek to the inside as Stuart Brubaker gets all kinds of sideways in turn one and two, but keeps it going. Just past halfway for Tyler Gunn, Caleb Henry, Cale Thomas, Stuart Brubaker, Sterling Kling, Chris Andrews, Mike Keegan, and Jerry Doms. Doctor's jacket in the air one more time around. He's already through turns three and four. He'll take the perfect heat race win for Tyler Gunn, second to Cale Henry. Eligible for the redraw, third Cale Thomas. Stuart Brubaker, fourth. Sterling Clinton, your final transfer spot. Chris Andrews, Mike Keegan, and Jerry Doms complete the field. Here we go, green out for heat race number two of three. DJ Foos with an excellent start down the front stretch in the one and two. Zane DeVault's been doing a lot of traveling with that lane racing number four though. He'll slide up in front out of turn two. Jordan Ryan in the third spot. Here comes DJ Foos racing to the inside. Slider in three and four, almost contact. Zane DeVault flying away out front. The battle is for second. DJ Foose and Jordan Ryan, the catfish on the bottom. Trey Jacobs in the fourth spot. Sean Rahal, the fifth and final transfer position. Henry Melquit, Cody Brewer, and Kelsey Ivey round out the field. winding down heat race number two Zane DeVault on cruise control out front of this one he's got a win at Butler Speedway up in Quincy Michigan this season Foose comfortably in second Jordan Ryan no challenge in third Trey Jacobs comfortably in fourth and Sean Rahal your final transfer car white flag in the air out of turn four for Zane DeVault Checkered flag for Zane DeVault, comfortably over DJ Foos. Jordan Ryan, Ben Jacobs, John Rahal, all thanks for the night, say me. After this three heats of the 305 sprints, then the late model B-Main, 410 B-Main, 305 B-Main. Green out for the third and final heat race. Mitch Harbaugh, TJ Michael side by side for the lead in the three and four. 
T.J. Michael leads lap one over Mitch Harbaugh, Zeth Sabo, Larry Kingsley Jr., and Cap Henry. Harbaugh gets all crossed up. Whoa, close quarters there. Cap Henry had to get hard on the brakes to avoid Mitch Harbaugh, who's all sideways out of turn two. A lot of momentum loss there for Cap Henry. Zeth Sabo out front now, this one, and pulling away. T.J. Michael in second, Larry King C. Jr. takes a peek to his inside in third. Mitch Harbaugh fourth, battle for the vinyl transfer spot. Cap Henry and Keith Shepard Jr. Henry, big run on Mitch Harbaugh, slider, make a slight contact in three and four. Three wide out of turn four for the vinyl transfer spot. Keith Sheffer from the tail of this one into that fourth position. Cap Henry now into fifth. Two to go. Now Cap Henry on the move. As he goes to the outside of Keith Sheffer, he'll take the four spot as the white flag goes in the air for Zeth Sabo. Flag for Zeth Jeff Sabo. Here's the race for second. Give it to TJ Michael, third. Larry Kingsley, Jr., fourth. Cap Henry, fifth. The key shepherd from the tail. It's hardball. 